Pearl Tutorial Part 13 Map and Grep Now um, Map and Grep are two great functions to use with arrays they're not actually loops but they they work like loops now first of all Map is a function that can do something with every item in an array so let's create an array of numbers 1 to 10 and we can say map and we put a couple of curly brackets in there and then we act upon our array and between here we don't have to refer to each item in our array by index number we can actually refer it to it by the default variable so we can say each item in the array equals itself multiplied by 2 and then we can print out our array so each item in the array will be multiplied by 2 so let's run this 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20. So every item in our array has been multiplied by 2. So the idea is, of map is to map an array, is to do something to the whole array to apply some kind of function. Now, I would like to show you a quicker way to actually write this instead of doing doing this part we can actually write in this okay so we can say variable times 2 and that's what it will equal so that's a quick way of doing what we've just just done okay but I'll take it I'll take it back so we can see um, the most simpler way. Okay, I'd now like to apply a map function to an array of of words. So let's create an array of fruit. Okay, so what shall we do with all these words? Do the same thing. Okay, map. Now let's let's just uppercase every every word. So let's each item in the array equals the uppercase. I haven't d explained this before, but to uppercase a a word, we just place U C in front of it and then the variable inside brackets so for each item in this array of fruit we're going to uppercase every word and then we're going to print out our array so let's rock that every item is an uppercase so that's map applying an equation or or something to the whole of an array now I'd like to explain grep now grep is a, a function that can extract items from an array that match a certain criteria so let's create our array of numbers 1 to 10 and let's say because we might want to still keep our original array intact so let's create a new array array 2 equals grep our curly brackets and then our array this is the array we're applying the grep to and we're going to create a new array so in here let's extract 
we again use our default variable. Let's extract all numbers that are greater than 5 and we're going to print our array 2. So grep will pull out all the numbers in this array that are greater than 5. Okay, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Now let's apply grep to our array of fruit. Okay, array 2 equals grep curly brackets our array we'll extract all the words here that contain so we use an equals and a tilde we'll extract all the words above that contain the letter N So let's print out our array. And we have orange and banana. So that's the basic workings of grep and map.